Chase Liaki here with the Blue Futon with a double feature. I think I'm done with the movies until Scream 6, Operation Fortune, and Creed 3. So let's do Operation Fortune first. I am a Guy Ritchie fan. This movie, I think, was supposed to come out last year. It was like a year delay. Who knows why? But anyway, I like this film. This is a fun spy movie. Kind of feels like a man from Uncle, but present day. Hugh Grant's great. Jason Statham's great. Aubrey Plaza's great. Everyone in this cast is fantastic. I enjoyed this film. Yeah, some dialogue felt a little bit forced on some scenes, especially with like Josh Hardnett. Some of his stuff, I was like, hmm, I don't understand the patriotic, if I don't vote Republican line, I don't really understand what that was supposed to be. Maybe it's supposed to be a dig at something. I don't know. But I think overall, it's a fun movie, and it's a movie I would watch again for sure. So Creed 3. Here's another one where I thought it was a pretty good film. Very formulaic. I understand the different camera movements he wanted to do. I feel like some of the boxing stuff was a little bit over-edited. Supposedly, it's supposed to be taking some anime references. I don't really watch anime, so I couldn't tell you which anime references there were. I do miss Ryan Coogler, like, one shot of, like, circling and having no edits. Here's a good amount of edits. And then there's this scene that they want to do at the very end where it goes from, like, round... Well, round two to round 12. Don't know if I was the biggest fan of it, but I do think as an overall boxing movie, it works. But I do feel like it is missing Rocky as a whole. Chase Huck with the Blue Food Talk. Comment, subscribe. Let me know what things Bouton Topia. Bouton Topia. Watch a freaking fantastic day, week, night, month, whenever you're watching this.